Hey guys, it's Emma. I'm back with another video. Today is my birthday haul. Um, so basically, it was my birthday nearly a week ago now, and I turned 22. And I just bought a few things with some birthday money that I got from my dad and my mom. And um, my work friends were so, so nice to me on my birthday because I actually worked on my birthday. But it was a Friday. And they were really, really nice. They bought me a cake, a card, and a gift voucher to my favorite uh, fashion jewelry store in Brisbane. So I was so happy that day. <laughs> they really treated me very well, and they are the best workmates that you could ever ask for. If you want to see pictures from my birthday, um, I've got a blog post, um, which I will link down below. And yeah, it just shows my pictures and um, they decorated my desk with pastel balloons. They know me very, very well. And yeah, it was just a really, really good day. And so anyway, I'm going to get into the haul. I'll start off with some shoes that I got. There's a store called Famous Footwear and they have a lot of cheap flat shoes. And I was kind of looking for more flat shoes because I'm just kind of getting sick of wearing heels. My feet are not loving me anymore. Um, I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm getting old now. I can't wear heels as, as often as I would like. So I bought four pairs of flat shoes. So the first pair I've got are these. <clears throat> and these, I don't know, I just thought they were really cute. They're, they're kind of almost like a winter version. And it's almost, well it is, it's spring now and it's almost summer, but they kind of look like winter shoes, but they're nice and airy, even though they are crocheted. So I'll show you what they look like close. They're just really cute little ballet pumps. And yeah, these are crocheted here and it's got some air flow. <laughs> um, they'll probably go with a lot of things being black and white, so... Those are probably going to be my one of my staple pair that I will wear very um, that I will wear a lot. So really happy with those. And I think those were fifteen dollars. I think they were a bit more expensive than the other ones. Um, and I think it's the same for these pair as well. But these ones, these are like that silver toe capped thing that's kind of popular at the moment. I really want a pair of heels with this on as well. I know I said I didn't want to wear heels as much, but just for going out, I like those plain black heels with the pointy, more of a pointy toe with the silver, but I really like these flat really cute, and they are another probably staple pair of shoes that I will wear a lot, being the colour that they are, they'll probably uh, look good with everything. And then the next two pairs of flats that I got are uh, identical, just with different colours. And the first pair are these bright orange um, cute pair, and I love the floral inside, even though you'll never see it, it's still kind of cute to be there. And yeah, they're just little pointy toed flats, they look like that, and they're bright orange. And I have a thing for orange, I still have a thing for orange. I have a thing for orange and a thing for mint. So, <laughs> I got a mint pair as well. And yeah, these, these two colours are my favourite colours at the moment when it comes to fashion. Um, they're not my favourite colour in general, really. It's just when it comes to fashion things. I love mint and I love orange. Um, so yeah. Does anyone, is anyone like that? They have a favourite colour and depending on what the object is. I don't really have a favourite colour in general. So, random stupid fact aside, um, that nobody really wanted to know. <laughs> but yeah, these, these cute little mint flats. Love those. So those are the four pairs of shoes I got. Um, the black ones were $15 and the um, mint and orange ones were $10 each, so that is such a bargain. I love Famous Footwear, they have a lot of bargains when it comes to shoes. Even their heels are cheap as well. I've had pairs of heels from Famous Footwear that were like $30 each, so if you're in Australia and you're near Famous Footwear, go there. And then I went to Sports Girl. I don't really shop at Sports Girl. Um, I think I've shopped there once my entire life, and that was about five years ago. So <laughs> this is what a sports girl bag looks like if you're not from Australia. I don't know if they have it anywhere else. Well, I was looking um, for some work clothes, but I didn't find anything. I don't actually think their clothes are worth the money. There's tops there that go up to $100, and I'm just... I'm such a cheapskate. I will never pay that much money for one shirt. Maybe a dress, but not a shirt. And I was mostly looking for shirts and pants, and they just didn't have anything that I really wanted. Got myself the first thing that I will show you. This is going to be kind of hard because it's massive, but it's this scarf. 
And I really want to show you the main print. Um, can you see that? It's got like skulls on it, which I kind of have an obsession with. And there's the other one in the yellow part. And then it's got writing all over it. And it's sort of, yeah, it blends in from purple to green, purple again, and then yellow. Yeah, and I just thought it was really cute and it looks really nice. Um, nice pastel colours and I like the fact that it's a pretty dainty scarf with a little bit of an edge. So it has those pretty feminine colours with the skull print. So I absolutely adore this scarf. <clears throat> and it's super, 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 super soft. So if you ever want really soft scarves, I've noticed that Sports Girl, all of their scarves are really, really soft. And they have some in bargain bins as well. I think they're usually $30 each, but I got this one for $15. So that's that scarf. So then I got... Sports Girl actually have a lot of iPhone covers. So I bought myself a heap of iPhone covers. They were reduced to $5 each. There's a little reduced sticker <clears throat> from $10. So this is my first one. And it's just a nice little stripey case with some flowers. Um, I got this small little feminine floral one. And this gorgeous little aztec -y one. I don't know, kind of aztec -y chevron type of print. And I think this one is my favourite. These last two are my favourites. Um, this is just, sorry about the shine, there's a window right behind the camera. Um, so this is kind of just, yeah, a floral, almost neon type of floral. I love it. And this one is definitely neon. It's this bright, oh, it's not really coming up true to colour. It's like a lime colour. It's not so much yellow. And it's just a bright, fluoro, neon, yellowy lime. With some studs. Studs and... Neon Lime, I think that would be my favourite combination, so those last two frame cases are my favourites. And then the last thing that I got from Sports Girl is this little ring. I got it, it's actually called a pinky ring, but I got it for my, um, what do you call it, above the knuckle type of ring. So I'll show you what it looks like, I'll put it on. That's the little ring, it's just a little love heart background. But yeah, it's just this little love heart, I'm going to wear it above the knuckle on, well, my rude finger. And yeah, I just really like it. It's really cute. And I've been looking for a lot of above the knuckle rings and I've been trying to purposely buy small rings, but the smallest rings are still a little bit too big and they end up slipping down my knuckles. So, but this is a pinky ring. They're calling it a pinky ring. So I just got that for my above the knuckle. So that's everything I got from Sports Girl. And the next place I went to was Cotton On. And I'd actually almost given up shopping by this point because I was originally looking for work clothes that I could also use as more like going out clothes as well so that I'm not just buying clothes for work and never wearing them. So I went shopping at Cotton On. I'd almost given up. I'd had no luck in any other shops, but they had 30, nothing over $30 at Cotton On, um, which I think lasts. It'll probably be finished by the time this video is up. But, so there's no point in telling you. Um, what was I saying? But yeah, so I went into Cotton On and everything was, yeah, uh, no more expensive than $30 per item. So I went a little bit nuts. So what should we do? I've got two massive bags absolutely filled with stuff. So the first thing that I got is this gorgeous lilac blazer and this was reduced, yeah this was originally $50 and it's now down to $30 with the sale and it's really 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 soft and I love the sleeves, they're cuffed and the inside lining have little puppy dogs on it so I thought that was cute. <clears throat> So yeah, and it is actually got um, shoulder pads in it, but they're not too overbearing. They look rather structured. They don't look 80s Nana-ish. The next thing I got was this bright yellow. Oh my god, it looks radioactive. <laughs> um, it's a bright yellow scarf, and it yeah, it's radioactive. 
that's all I'm going to say about this. But I just love how bright this is. You will not miss me. You will always see me coming. And yeah, it's just a really pretty scarf. I'm a little bit obsessed with scarves lately, so... I, yeah, that is just a gorgeous, bright, radioactive scarf that a lot of people are going to give me stares for. But that's okay. And it just has this little, like, what do you call that? Fraying at the ends, which gives it a nicer touch, I think. That's that one. Okay, so the next two things that I bought are skirts. And the first one is a wine colour. And it's just a skirt to be worn kind of high-waisted. And they're really, really flattering. So they're a little bit, what is it, pleated. But yeah, they're very, very flattering. I will wear them a little bit high-waisted. And they're perfect for work. And I also bought a black one. A black one and a wine-coloured one. Which I think were cute. And I think these were $20 anyway, so they weren't part of the sale. But $20 is pretty cheap for um, a skirt. And the next thing, this was also $20. This is a top, which is actually unbuttoned, so it's not going to look very pretty. But it's just a sheer sleeveless top that buttons up at the front with a little bit... Uh, it's not really a collar, but yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I'm so rubbish at explaining things. Just look at it, okay? Just look. Just look at it. <laughs> and then the next thing I got, these are gorgeous. I got three pairs of skinny jeans. They're actually, um, they don't look like jeans, so I can wear them to work. And my work is quite flexible with what we can wear, as long as we look smart. It's kind of like, the dress code is smart casual, basically. So. I got these jeans and they are floral skinny jeans which I love and they're actually very flattering I'm never used to wear skinny jeans but I think that they've kind of perfected them and they've made them more flattering for a curvier um, curvier lady because I have a butt and I have hips and I have short legs because <laughs> which uh, things that really don't really go with skinny jeans usually, but they look really nice and they're very flattering. So, I bought two more pairs. So this is my other pair. And I like these. These are black with kind of almost... Yeah, I don't know what these are called. Are they hibiscus flowers? I think they might be hibiscus flowers, but it's almost Hawaiian. And I've noticed that the fashion at the moment is going into Hawaiian prints. Some of it gets a little bit... Ugh. Scary. So this is kind of a muted version and I really like it and they're very flattering being the colour black with some, it's kind of like an edge to just a plain black skinny jean so I really really like them. So the last pair of jeans that I got are also floral, I'm just sort of teeming with a the theme here and they are blue jeans with some, they're kind of actually red, they look more pink on camera. Um, like a red peach flower and they're really cute okay so those are the three skinny jeans I got and again they were originally yeah they were all originally $50 and with the sale they were $30 so I saved $20 per pair so that's already $60 <laughs> I had to really think about that I am so bad at maths moving on and then the last thing that I got um, was from Colette. I spent a little bit of money there because I had my voucher from my lovely workmates. And yeah, Colette is basically, if you're not from Australia, it's, it's a fashion jewellery store, so it's all costume jewellery. And also handbags and wallets and clutches. And yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I think that's all they sell. Oh, they've sell, they also have a few things like scarves and iPhone cases. So... Pretty much just accessories. And so the main thing that I went there for was this bag. And it's actually a satchel. And it's this bright neon yellow satchel. Which actually reminds me of that satchel that everyone went crazy for. What's it called? Um, the Ca Cambridge satchel. 
That's all you ever saw on eBay. They called them Cambridge satchels and they were bright neon yellow or bright neon pink. And they had pink as well, but I think this, it's almost lime. So it's kind of a greenish yellow, which I prefer. I don't really like the yellow that doesn't have a bit of a greenish tint when it's neon. So I really, really like that. And I think that even if it gets marks, um, it's not too bad because uh, it does easily get marks, but it, they come off so easily because of the material that it's made out of. And it does have a long strap. Oh, the strap, these just come off like that. You don't have to like fiddle with too many clasps. And it has a long strap inside. And yeah, I mean, it's quite roomy too. Could probably fit quite a bit in there. And yeah, I've been eyeing this for ages and I'd never had enough money. And then I got my voucher on my birthday and I bought it and I was so happy. And while I was in Colette, I said to myself I was only going to get that bag, but I ended up with some jewellery and a wallet. And to be fair, I needed a wallet because my old one was falling apart and basically giving me a nightmare. So I bought this wallet and it's kind of matchy-matchy with my neon yellow face. But yeah, it's a nude coloured wallet with yellow accents, that neon yellow lime. And it just unclips like that. And inside is like gold. I can't show you right inside because all my stuff is inside. But yeah, I'm already using that and I already love it. And I love the size of it. It's not so massive that it doesn't fit in any of my handbags. But it's not too small that it doesn't fit all my cards. And I definitely have a lot of cards because I love, I don't know, I love getting store cards. You always get so many rewards and I shop enough that I actually do get rewards, which is kind of scary. So then I got some jewellery because everything has been 50% off too. So I got heaps of jewellery. I got this ring, which is kind of, it's almost like, it looks like it's lace, but it's gold. So I got that ring. And then I also got two necklaces. And this is the first necklace. It's a lilac kind of chunky necklace that sits about here and yeah I also got this one and this is like a peach peachy gold almost vintage looking necklace and again that sits about there and then I was only going to get those three things but then I got to the counter and I saw this ring and I'm one of those people that get sucked in by the counter things but it's this massive gold chunky ring with pink stone. It's absolutely massive. But I love it. I love the pink on it. It's not really coming up well on camera. I think it's something to do with the window in the background. It looks, it looks more washed out. But it is a bright, bright pink with the gold around the outside. And the gold is almost a rose gold, which is kind of cool because it suits the pink. So yeah. So that's pretty much nearly a... Oh, um, I also got these earrings that I'm wearing today. I don't know if you can see them, but they've got a little stone with pink, like a bright pink design. And I've got them in yellow as well. They came in a um, two-pack. So that was also Colette. So that is absolutely everything. I am now surrounded by all my clothes and stuff, which is where I want to be in life, really. So that's absolutely everything, and I shall see you guys in my next video. Bye! <laughs> so that's everything, and thank you for watching. I should probably give a better ending than that. How do you end videos? <sighs> Food now. Work clothes. I have a hair on my face. What the hell? Oh, that's annoying.